Howdy folks, this is Jackers back again with another episode of Morris Goes to Oblivion, this time with episode 126, I do believe, and we are here in coral under a beautiful night sky, moon drifting by like a ship on the ocean, an ocean made of diamonds. I am hanging in there, and I will turn it over now to... Morris the High Elf. Yes. Yes, as I recall, we have acquired, although not donned, the gauntlets of the Crusader, although our gauntlets, as they are, I believe, help us to carry our load, so perhaps we shall not remove them at the moment. What we should do, unquestionably, is switch to Dee Dee's book. Page in the book, I should say. And what do we need? Do we need a mace? Why don't we? Sir Ralphus has told me where to find the mace of Zenithar. In order to recover the mace, I must travel to the chapel of Zenithar in Leowin. In the undercroft of the chapel, I must kneel at the shrine there. According to Sir Ralvis, I will be tested, and my faith will be my guide. So, let's go to Leowin and find out if I have a bounty there or not. So far, so good. Hello. Better than most. Something to report? I, well, you are treating me rather better than most Go guards. Ahead. Good for you. I suppose we could still try to sweeten your disposition. So you like these two. I like and that. Dislike not. You're... the others. I doubt it. Well, don't doubt I like anything. Not... Blow away, windbag. I like how. Blow... I doubt it. Ah, I see. That? That's good. This is You're not going to work in our favor this it. time. How? Hello. I. D That's great. How's it go again? How? T I doubt. I like well that a lot. That's wonderful. All right. Ah. Uh, you too. Cheering up guards. One piece of pie at a time. All right, we are going to the chapel, I believe. Such a beautiful day and such beautiful accompaniment. As if the very land were musical. Oh, Cyrodiil. It's you. Probably. You. You're the one restoring the Knights of the Nine, aren't you? Well, I am used to being noticed, but not for that. You certainly are the first. Or maybe not. My memory isn't what it used to be. But yes, I am. And you are? My name is Kennedy Sohola. Like you, I am a servant of the Nine, specifically of Zenithar. Ah. I came here seeking his mace. However, I could not pass the test. I'm just... I'm no crusader, but... That doesn't mean that I cannot serve Zenithar. In light of recent attacks, I've signed on to protect the chapel. I'm fair with a blade, and by my honor, I'll serve the Nine in any way I can. Good lad. What can you tell me about the mace? Legends say that when Pelinald Whitestrike was slain by the Aelids, a messenger carried the mace to the human settlement of Leowen. As a message. You mean this settlement? Centuries later, the master craftsman St. Canadus built the chapel of Zenithar in Leowen as a tribute to the legend. When St. Canadus was laid to rest, those who prayed to Zenithar at his tomb began to receive visions of the mace of the Crusader. Fascinating. Now, again, it may, may be my memory, but I could almost swear that when you introduced yourself, you did as Calidus, was it? Instead of Carodus? But I can't go back. Uh, let us see, though. 
What can you tell me of a Leowin? Why doesn't the Elder Council send the Legion to help us? There's no telling when another Oblivion Gate will open. Oh, we'll get to it. Don't worry. What do you know about Zenithar? Of the original Divines, Zenithar is thought to be the most in touch with the mortal realm. Some legends say that Zenithar has close ties to Kinnereth, an idea that is supported by the manner in which the two gods' realms interact. Craftsmen devoted to Zenithar are able to create and profit from the materials provided by Kinnereth's natural world. I see. The two work in harmony. The natural world providing for the craftsmen. One cannot revere Zenithar without acknowledging the power of Kinnereth. And what do you know of the Prophet? He seems to be different than your usual self-proclaimed holy man. Oh, that is true. Maybe what he says is true. That the attack on the Chapel of Devela is but just the beginning of an assault on the church itself. And is there anything else you can tell me about the Mace of Zenithar? Legends say that when Pelinal Whitestrake was slain by the Aliens, a messenger... So no. Centuries later, the master craftsman, St. Calidus... No. When St. Calidus was laid to rest... Yes, you, you've already covered that, I do believe. Well, let's... Certainly. Oh, no need there. Good man, you have excellent opinions of me. Aye. As you should. So, as I recall, we are to go to the Undercroft. Hopefully, the dead won't mind. Are you a friendly ghost? Oh, you are. Well. Hello. Uh, I say, spirits, do any of you know where the, uh, altar is? It's not just this fellow in the back, is it? Tomb of St. Calidus. I thought it was an altar. Well, I suppose we can sort of look like we're kneeling. Oh my. Do you know, they told me it wasn't Skuma. I should not have believed them. The path of the righteous. I've knelt before the shrine of St. Calidus in Leowen and found myself transported to some sort of dark void. I can see the mace of Zenithar off in the distance, but there seems to be no way to reach it. According to Sir Ralvus, I must allow my faith in the Nine to guide me to the mace. All right. Oh my. Well. Almost like a warbird. Anyway, um, hmm. Well, this is unquestionably a moment for the space time key. In for a penny, in for a pound. And a fall. Well, that's why we have a space-time key. All right. I've stepped into the void to try and reach the Mace of Zenithar, but my feet met nothing but air and I fell into the darkness. There must be a way to walk between the platforms and reach the Mace. Yes. One would believe that. But... I am not sure. Hmm. Have a faith, but verify. Not silver, not elven. You know, I need to pick up some rather useless arrows at some point. Dwarven. Out of curiosity. Is 
it looked like such a natural point. Hmm. There does appear to be something over there. But I don't see how that is useful. Hmm. What am I missing? There is little to nothing to interact with. There is a platform above us, but... Perhaps rather than a bow, perhaps a bit of magic. Detect life. Oh, uh, let's see. Hmm. Whoops. Well, perhaps I should not have done that. Ah. Uh, you know, sometimes testing magical theories are a bit dangerous. It is a good thing, therefore, that we have this be- Well, you know what. I imagine I'm just going to fault my demise anyway, so off we go. Alright, that wasn't an option. <laughs> All right. On the plus side, they're not killing us for this. Was the mace restored? Ah, it was not. Well then, just a moment while we reload space and time. Ah, uh, not the autosave. Yes, good. Wait. Oh, goodness. Have I done something? No, no, no. There it is. All right. That was a bit unnerving. Well, I can't get to it, but I can certainly knock it out of my way. I feel like faith would be a simple walk, but I also feel that is not what is happening. That is fascinating. I wish I could see better. There are spirits there. Is that the Undercroft? Those, I think, are the sanctified spirits. Well, wonderful, that doesn't help us either. Uh, what is our... no, well, no, don't bother, we're just going to fall to our demise. Uh, not this either. Uh, let's see. Uh, thinking clearly is not always my forte. We may need to... hmm drift through time a bit before I figure this out, so <laughs> there may be space and time missing from the record. Well, first, let's stop this. Not quite able to get up there. Not that I know that it would do me any good. What? Oh, what would... I... 
I don't... Well, there are the clouds. I could try to run and jump, but that did no better. Stepped into the void, yes, yes, as we have done before. Maybe I need to go pray to Zenithar before I do this. Well, off we go. Where's the door? Anyway, I swear that was this that we were looking at. All right. Uh, wooden door. Wait. Where are we? All right, this is not what I expected. Ah, I see. Well met. Wait, what? No, no, right chapel. All right, bit confused. Okay, Dibella. Oh, let's just go through the nine here. Stendar, Talos, Zenithar. We've done a pilgrimage. Greetings, high elf. Well, greetings. Does it? Well, I suppose we could put the gloves on as well. Perhaps we need more of the other pieces. Merciful touch added. What is that? Oh, good question. Oh, I think it was just the boost tool. Restoration. Although perhaps not. Perhaps it is actually an ability. It is. Restore health. 50 points on touch. <sighs> no, I must confess. I do not recall the steps I need to take, nor am I clear on the path. All right, this would be a foolish thing, but let's step off backwards. No. I thought look ah! without... Oh, look at that time. I actually did manage to die. Who says I don't know how to have any fun? All right. There we are. Still wearing... These switch to those. All right, let's look at what abilities we do have. Merciful Touch. But I don't believe that's done us any favors. I really wish I could just get up on that ledge. I don't know that it would do me any good whatsoever, but... Hmm.
No, I was looking the other way when I fell backwards, although fascinating that I got all the way to the bottom of that. Let's try bringing a friend and then returning to our flare. Dee Dee, darling, where are you? Oh, that is fascinating. We summoned a Daedroth, but perhaps she's back in the Undercroft. Well, if she is, I don't see her unless she's fighting the spirits. Perhaps there are a few less. Oh, heavens, I do not know what we are to do here. And we will see if I figure it out. Hmm. We've stepped off this way. We've stepped off here. There's no reason to step off any point between either edge I could imagine. Hitting the mace, yes. We have done that, as a matter of fact. No, it's there. Perhaps if we focus only on the mace? No, 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 no. Back to death we go. Ow! Heavy sigh. I stepped into the void to try and reach the mace, but my feet met nothing but air, and I fell into the darkness. There must be a way to walk between the platforms. What platforms? And reach the mace. All right, let's see. We, do we have, th no, we still don't have the gloves on. Gauntlets of the Crusader. The only thing I can think is perhaps we need more pieces. Is there anything According to so row this, I must allow my faith in the nine. Maybe, well, it's a sacrificial thing. Just, you know, nine deaths. Maybe that's the problem. Maybe I keep dying. If I just take nine walks off the edge without hitting the column. No idea. Let's call that one. I've stepped into the void to try and reach the mace. There must be a way to walk. Yes, yes, we've seen this before, but I perhaps have been interfering unintentionally. Oh, I don't see the mace. I still don't see it. I am concerned. All right, that, that was two. I had to be the magical Ultima and try and strike it. No, wait, I see it. It is laying down. We can't quite, well, you know, no, if I jump too close. Well, let's, I think it's laying down on the altar now instead of sort of floating diagonally. That's three. Faith in nine, here we come. All right. Four. we. It's a shame Dee Dee doesn't come here. Oh wait, what? 
My attempts to reach the Mace of Zenithar have been unsuccessful. No kidding. No matter what I try, I cannot reach the other platform. Perhaps if I continue my quest for the other relics, an answer will present itself, of course. Well, could you not have mentioned that? Any of you? Well, of course you're just bones now. Heavy sigh. All right, uh... You know, that... That was quite a bit of accomplishing nothing, but I think perhaps we will... No, I do not wish to admit to him that we have failed. We're just going out for lunch as we ponder. Ah, uh, okay. What do we have here? The gauntlets, yes, yes. Shield. Let's get the armor first. Oh, wait, what do we... Instructed to find the Shrine of Kinnereth. They said that they both, I believe, the spirit and the supplicant there mentioned that Kinnereth and Zenithar had a connection. So, Cyrodiil's great forest and speak with the priests there about the boots of the Crusader. So let us go to the middle of nowhere. Or, at the very least, the chestnut handy stables. And, uh, perhaps we will just travel to the edge here and call that our journey. All right. Beautiful. Well, on the plus side, we get to go for a lovely walk, and we did get to explore the falling through dreams, dying in dreams, and, well, summoning an invisible Daedroth. So there was all of that. And when next we meet, we shall strike out, hopefully. I could have sworn we've been here before, but then they say we've just discovered it. Oh, you know, I... I must admit that Checkers the Human's memory is having an effect on myself as well. But for the moment, we shall pause our journey here in this gorgeous setting and pick up again when next we meet. For the moment, I would like to say thank you so much for joining the Invisible DD, myself, and of course, Checkers the Human on our journey to do very little. Uh, we hope you found it at least not completely boring and that you at least had maybe just a moment of some joy from it. And along those lines, we'd like to invite you to think of something that brings true joy to your heart, just as Dee Dee loves to chase her prey. Most of all, though, we would like to ask you to please, please, take care.